Alright guys, welcome back to Divinity. Kand is making a shit ton of potions. Uh, so, last time we were trying to uh, find a way to get the ship started. Uh, and apparently we have a bunch of quests here that are locked. So, it says, uh, there's, there's some kind of song that's controlling a ship. I did pick up a bunch of books and stuff, so maybe I'll just look through, through them briefly. Uh, particularly because... Uh, Ken, these are these are amazing boots. You should take those. Sure. Pass them over. I've yeah. spotted something. Uh, I've spotted something. Okay, there's some really shit stuff here, actually. What is that? Yeah, what's on the floor here? Floorboard. Uh, what, this? I, I hate you to spot it. Is that a trap? I'm gonna just step on it. Oh, shit. Oh, dude, step on it. I'll get it, I'll get it. It's mine. Oh, shit, we found a uh, button. Okay. Oh, a button! What was in that? Oh, dude, there's some gloves in there. Oh, fuck, I'm going in. Gotta go in there. There's a lot of amulets and stuff. This is sellable things, so I'll just let you have it. And, and potion stuff. Gold pile! I'll take that. I'll requisition that. Resurrection scroll. Effin can have that. I don't know, I'm not sure. Does so Effin kind. Really, does Effin really want, like, those kinds of things? I think everyone, want, everyone wants resurrection scrolls, really. No, 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 the resurrection, uh, sorry, restore scrolls. Sorry, did I say the wrong thing? I may have said the wrong thing. I mean, pass them around, like, if, if someone doesn't have it, sure, I'll give it to them. I found a, I found a pair of gloves for uh, Beast, unironically. This book is unreadable, thanks. Ah, oh, Skull Glove. I think it's something better, he does. I don't want this smelly panties. Steam Lance, I'm just gonna send that to you because I don't want it. Like, I just sell it. Well, it's hard to, it's hard to surface, so I might have that. Alright, one second, being... Messaged. I forgot to turn myself to do not disturb. Whoops. All right. <laughs> the page is split into three columns. In the leftmost column is a series of words in an unfamiliar language. The middle uh, common is a ser series of common words. The right is a column of numbers. Oh, it's a code book. Or no, wait, it's a low, no pay taking book. Probably a code book though. Huh. Oh yeah, you're the one with all the selling stuff, right? Yes, and the bottom man. Uh. Yeah, and then Beast has all the. Uh, Have you been giving shit to Beast? Uh, I was giving I was giving papers for crafting to you, so. All right, we got our. Money's a little bit mad. All right. Well, I mean. You know, I have I have things for you here, like you know, like this. You should take that. <laughs> I can't. So I what you can do is pick it up, give it to me in my inventory. It it, it doesn't actually, you know, it doesn't actually sell for a lot, right? It sells for garbage. <laughs> I just have it. Alright, we have this door open now. All right, so we haven't actually found the solution here yet. There's glasses here. Oh wait. Solution to what? How did you not pick up the glasses? I uh, I didn't get around to loot that side of the room. Wow. Get on my level. And the skull actually sells for a lot. Why does the skull sell for a lot? I don't know. They're uncommon. Okay, I'll give you some more crap to sell. Why do I have why do I have strange gem? Oh, uh, that's something I, I I think that was the thing related to the quest line actually. Oh uh, dude dusty tome, that sounds like right up my alley. This is written in ancient lizard script. It appears to be a song. Oh, I love a song. All right. Well, um, I'll sing this one for you. It's it's an excellent song. Zerg Zach Zers Yerk Zerg Okay. He's still giving me socks, fucker. <laughs> oh, I want to stop finding them. Under lock and key. Sorry, I had to sneeze. All right. Gesundheit. These uh. These pants suck balls, thank you. Oh fuck, do you level too low? Pick it up! What are you talking about? Find a chest. I don't want these pants either. So where's this chest? <laughs> hey, where am I? You're in the bed. <laughs> yeah, I am. <laughs> Actually underneath the sheets. All right, well, <laughs> scary. We solved the riddle of the uh, the Sphinx. 
So we can probably just, you know... Probably just go. Oh yeah, someone was saying, I think, just before I go... By the way, we're like way ahead, so the comments are like coming in now for some of the things we're doing on the island. Not, not even, not way ahead, just a little ahead. Just a little ahead. Someone said, someone was suggesting I do some scoundrel on Seaville. And it doesn't actually sound like a terrible idea, honestly. Because, I mean, it gives me critical multiplier, but I, I can also pick up a couple of scoundrel skills. Like adrenaline. Yeah, well, I think I have that already. On yeah, Hunter. but... No, I don't. You can't use it. No, I'm, I'm, a, I'm a filthy... Oh, no, I do have it. What do you mean? I, I can use it now. <laughs> I have it now. There's no, no no problems with that. But you can use it? Yeah. Sure, why not? It, it just gives me more uh, more stuff. And probably at some point, I think one of the one of the things we can get is Mean Tonic. The one that gives you three extra points of memory. That would be really good. But not now. Because I have... Shooting arrows will inflict bonus damage based upon the target your services. Uh, yeah, yeah, whatever. It's fine. I don't mind that. Because if they're if I make them stand in blood, then it's like super damage. All right, let's uh, let us go on a merry adventure uh, up to the uh, up to the uh, the poop deck. You know what? I mean, sure. Let's go to the poop deck. That's a thing, right? Yeah, I know. It's where you could take a poop. All right. I've been on a boat before. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna go and, uh... I'm gonna go talk to the thing over here and sing a song to it. A merry tune. Oh, you gonna sing it for me as well? Uh, fuck no. Uh, it's between me and the, the wood. I warned you. Alright. Well, let's give it a good old see of Rooney. The figurehead looms ahead, continuing its silent watch over the seas. Sing the song from the tome you found below decks. The deck beneath you groans and trembles, like the ship itself is awaking from a slumber. A deep sigh emerges, unmistakably the sound of a living being. Did you get the cutscene? Yep. It fucking looked at me. You... You are not the witch. You are not Dallas. You sang the song. Now you must decide my fate. Are you to be my new master? Uh, hesitantly admit that you see the flaws in your people's use of slavery after your time in Fort Joy. The ship is free and equal and allied. Is the ship free now? Let's make a free ship. It's Fine. nice the ship. It's a free ship. Perhaps lizard blood does not truly run cold then. Thank you. But I cannot be free again. Not truly. I am a vessel and must be guided. Let me take you wherever you wish. We can depart as soon as you are ready. So you want to know more about the ship? Ask. I am here to serve in all ways. Uh. Remark that whatever spirit resides as wood had must have had a previous existence. Can I remember anything? The creaking of the ship eases into a contemplative silence. Once, I was an elf. I passed away and was reborn as an ancestor tree in a beautiful forest surrounded by kin of both flesh and root. But that time has passed. I saw that forest reduced to a dead place. Then I was taken away. My memories were lost, like the leaves from my branches. Note that you have heard live would only come from the ancestor trees of the elven homeland, but those forests were sacrificed in the wars of the previous generation. Sacrifice must be made willingly. Our home was stolen from us. Magisters destroyed our way of life to end the war they started. Then they uprooted me and... and... They... They tore me apart and turned me into this... monstrosity. And that's it, you've heard enough for now. It's time, time to prepare to say it. Wow, that's, that's really cold. Of course. Wherever there is sea, I will endeavor to bring you. Consult with your companions and set a course. The ship's oh alive. shit! Good. Is she ready to sail? It's ready to sail. A slow, toothless smile stretches across her face. To driftwood, then. 
Alright, make sure you've chosen keen travel companions for this may be the last chance to change your party. Alright, all right. do you have the, your party members that you want? Yeah, I have my buddy. Alright. It most certainly is. Forward. The ship is awake. Of course I'm ready. With the sun on their backs and the wind in their sails, the god woke and watched Fort Joy shrink behind them. But their capture of the Lady Vengeance had not gone unnoticed. Oh shit. Oh shit! Pirate combat. I respect your metal, sorcerers. You steal my ship, kill my bishop and ally with demons. But you have no idea what you're really dealing with. I think we just found a... Hello again, Sauce Hunter! Hello, Sauce Hunter! <laughs> we are ready, mistress. Yes, but are they? I swear, mistress. I swear they'll perform admirably. <laughs> Very well. Show me. Goodbye, sorcerers. Goodbye, sauce hunter! Uh, we're, we're not allowed to do any kind of, like, buffing for this. Nope. This is my ship. I won't see it taken from under my feet. You, act! Yes. Oh, God. Mistress. Oh, for the love of the... Void. Listen up. We can't win this one, but I can get us to safety. You'll need to buy me time. Show us what you can do, Godwoken. Godwoken? Parasites, rather. I'll take care of it, <laughs> mistress. <laughs> Fucking hell, I love these guys. I'll take care of it, Sauce Hunter. More than just a <laughs> metaphor, shall Why? we? Fire and malediction. That burning. It's like a bomb in my belly ready to burst. Uh, probably just go for the high ground. That way, you won't blow up on everyone else. It says a magic bomb was attached to this character, and we'll, and we'll go off when the status expires. Is this, is this like a hot potato skill? Are you living bomb right now? I, well, I know, but it says um, after one turns, nothing. After two turns, blows up your target. Yeah, you want me to go on the high ground beside the oral barrel? Yeah. All right, sure. Why not? Well, you go up there and throw it down onto them. Actually, see if you can do that. That might actually be good. Oh, like, like actually throw it. It's actually just drag it, like drag it across the yeah, ground. Yeah, I, I just tried. I'm not allowed to do that for some reason. I, I could teleport it, though. He's got scrolls for this stuff. Okay, I'm gonna try and blow up the other oil barrel and spread the fire. You're blown up? I, I I mean, I have fire arrows. Oh, sure, go for them. It's possible that this may not have been a good idea to do flash a, a, a sacrifice, but you know. Nah, no, you'll be fine. No, the box! Wait, so what, why, why are me and uh, fucking Beast on the other side? <laughs> I mean, I could. You like death, I guess? I, I, I could just fly over to safety, but I don't know about Beast. Beast is gonna be fucking. Uh, this is gonna suck. I kinda want that blood up there, but. Mm. Yeah, you can put a totem there. No, fuck totems. I need to get my incarnate out. Okay. I'd rather have one of blood, but I, I, I don't think I can have him up there. So I'll just have a wood one, I guess. A weaponized monk. Alright, so we're starting to get into things that are, like, kind of, like, immune to physical, but not magical, and then vice versa. I'm noticing. Where's weaponized monk? Uh... Oh, I see. Like, the fucking dog guy? Yeah. And then the silent monks have no physical armor. But these things are all like level A. What the fuck is this? <laughs> it's technically on par with what we had, but we were used to. We had it easy on the island, apparently. 
do an encourage, I think. That all hits the beetle. That's nice. Yeah, she needs some encouragement right now. She's a bomb right now. Well, she'll be a dragoon soon. How much damage is that gonna do? We'll find out. I I'm just getting ready with the res scrolls, to be honest. Fuck it. I'm just gonna hold my ground here. A line must be drawn here. Uh, yeah, no further. The yeah, problem is you're hitting the two things with physical armor, like a ton of it. Well, I got much choice. I mean, we could stun them with something magical. Could. That's yeah, the fire. Where... Oh, really? Oh, she doesn't care. Armor Frost. Well, she just I mean, gave that just one. holding out. That's why I'm just freaking like, just... They call it as a tank. <laughs> oh Dude, my is God. that me from Divinity 1? Yeah. Skull! Uh, I'm not sure what the fuck to do here. I mean, I don't know either. I mean, I, I was just planning on going to the other side, but you know. I can go up and start engaging the watch up there, I guess. Do you have do you have, a ma do you have a magical armor skill? I mean, I have that, but I, don't, I have nothing that can restore your magic armor now. Uh, I was just thinking you can fortify Sabiel's magic armor to maybe so she doesn't die. No, no. Why don't you why don't you maybe deal with the silent monk or something? I'm thinking. Ah, uh, fuck it, fuck it. I'll just do a bouncing shield. Okay. Like, we're not gonna kill anything here, I don't think. Alright. Uh, let's see here. Uh. Maybe go up and chicken the silent watcher up on the high ground. Uh, I don't know, man. I guess I could do that. Alright. So I think this is gonna be more of a damage control fight. Of course, Phoenix Dive. I need more time. I mean she used it on that person. Person who said bias time. Fuck what? Weaponized monk cast blight. Uh, she's got a lot of uh, HP and, and stuff. Oh get get away from Sabiel. Uh, we have problems there. A lot of problems right now. <laughs> he just took damage <laughs> from the fire. Arc. Stop that elf! Her sorcery must be silenced. Arc. I need more time. You will not take me again, Dallas. <laughs> Stop talking to fucking beast. Caught up with the boat is very <laughs> persuasive. Vengeance! What the fuck just happened? What the fuck just happened? Blew up. So we got buffed. Yeah, we got like a lead ship buff, bro. Yeah, the ship buffed us. Nice. Alright. <laughs> that constitution probably just saved your ass. Dude, you have so much health now? Dude! What? How much health do I have? Oh, yeah. 300. It's like. Fuck. Double what you had. I wanna invest into a fucking constitution. Second. Let's try doing this thing. You have some magic arrows you could. Yeah. Okay, that. Magic shell is he, moved by shocked. But he's if in. If he moves, he'll get shocked. Yeah. Uh, do you have a shocking arrow? Because that also puts stun on him. Uh, put uh, put stun on him. Or shocked on him, and then he'll get stunned if he tries to move. Uh. I might. Yeah, I do. Cause like those arrows are actually kind of easy to make, just teeth and uh, a knife. There you go. 
You know what I mean, he just has like mostly he's got no magic armor, so. I don't leave my spot too much. So I think when it says hold them off, I think we're just supposed to kill them all. I think we're just meant to, you know, pull them <laughs> off. She's got mutton, mug of wine, <laughs> and drunk. Wait, why is there a fucking, why is there a package there? Where? Like right next to this doggo. Trying to see what you're talking about. It's like between Gareth and the weaponized monk. Uh. Alright, I'm thinking of teleporting the watcher away because he just uses dives, it's hard for him to get back. I'll teleport him like uh, in the fire, I guess. Yep. Go fuck yourself, shithead. Oh, he's warm. <laughs> Children move by burning. And then I think I'm gonna just maybe try and get the fuck out of this cursed blood. And, uh. I think I'm good from there. Oh no, I can do this. I'll, yeah, sure, why not? So here's a question, do we want to focus anything down at the moment? Right now I'm just thinking I'm going to try and do as much as I can to knock people down. This should hit this guy, right? Yeah, it will. Okay. Black. <laughs> yeah, because like, I'm here, but like I can... But you can still have wings up, though. Yeah, but I can go slap this this chicken's shit though. Do what you want to do? I mean, what? I mean, what? What do I want to do with it? Is the question. Isn't it a bow thing? It's a ranger, yeah. Okay. Well, probably I want to fuck it up, right? I mean, I I can't think of a better target besides going for uh, Milady. It's the only thing I can think of. But apparently I can't really go anywhere, actually with fly right now. Oh, because everything's out of sight, because I'm in a smoke cloud. You still have turn on fly, don't you? Yeah, you do. Yeah. If these rats kill me, we're all done for. I can't. You'll be fine, my lady. You see, you got stunned. Excuse me? You can't just walk past this layers here? Alright, maybe I should fly over there and help you guys out, actually. I mean, we, it's pretty easy to buffer, though. Yeah, she is. I'm gonna store her stuff into this. Fucking hell! Alright, yeah, we kinda need to deal with these things. Do it. They're just focusing her down, they don't even care Defend about us. Me, don't stop. It's working. Defend me or don't stop, it's working! <laughs> Good advice. Uh, she turns the build around and start getting some damage on. If you can yeah. heal off some of the physical armor. Give me that. So I don't know if a magic armor, but I can't do it. Why do I have a scroll for that, actually? Uh, two, uh the weaponized monk has no armor now, so you can knock him down. Uh, I mean... I'm just giving you your options, just to let you know. You want me to do that? I guess I can do that. Sticky oh, arrow. it's load. Oh, whoops, that wasn't my stunning arrow, that was my slowdown arrow. I mean, that's still okay to use. I'm gonna fucking Super Mario my way over there. I think I'm gonna have to go join the fray with my incarnate as well. Yeah, because they're focusing down that person. Is there any kind of armor buffs we can give her, or no? I can buff her. But fortify, I can do a beast. Yeah. yeah, give her fortify. 
Unfortunately, I can't get much closer, but I can try and peel off some of their armor so I can do some shit like that. Not enough. Oh, come on. Peel off their armor. <laughs> come on. You can do more than that. Come on. Nope. Bitch. Dude, it's drunk. Have you ever been drunk? How many AP points do you have when you're drunk, Ken? You're at the pub with your mates. Come on. Alright, that works. Okay. Uh, is there any blood surface in there somewhere? Hey, there is! Get pooped out to the side, though. Oh well. <laughs> I'll go ahead and put a heal on her as well. No! <laughs> Died immediately. How much time does that do? Not enough. Decay. Because he went, uh. Wait, he's not decaying. What are you saying, decaying? No, it says decaying blocked. Oh, yeah, because the it's cursed blood. Oh, okay. Okay. I can't do what I want to do from here. So, I'll do this instead. That works. The CBO didn't get it. It's a lot of fortifies. Keeping it healthy. Defend me or die. Alright. You wanna see some balance? <laughs> when did you get a bomb put on you? I I don't know when. But here's some balance. <laughs> Stop that! Don't, don't get too close, wait till you explode next turn. Uh, here's a... So I'm debating what to do here. Uh, yeah, I know what to do here. Remember me. I worked out actually pretty well. Yeah, it didn't actually fuck anything up that bad, but... I think the lady's gonna... die. No, it should be fine. Uh, living metal won't do anything here. Who doesn't have physical armor here? Milady. Maybe the okay the weapon I have is retarded, so maybe that's how we. No, it, it couldn't attack. And they also don't like being in fire. Ow. If these brats kill me, we're all done for. Stop her! Arg! Burning blocked my magic armor. Alright, who, who's our target here? Okay, well, unfortunately, it would appear that uh, everybody's out of sight. Because you're in a smoke cloud. Yeah, that happens. Uh, right. I mean, I can't tactical retreat, really. But I can just, I can just walk up, you know. There we go. Who's the target? Should I try and finish off that monk? You could. Uh, I could probably get him this turn, or I can start working on the Geist or something. I mean, any, any physical arm you can peel off is good for me, because then that means I'm on beast turn, I can do a knockdown. Alright, I'm gonna do one arrow on that guy and two on the monk. Okay. I need more Almost there. A little longer. Well, honestly, I'm looking at this, I'm like, you know, we could probably do this. It's probably not the boss there. <laughs> Hmm. 
mean, she's fine. Good enough. There you go. Oh shit, last hit. <laughs> Kill steel. What's this guy gonna do now? Like, ah oh, shit. Explosive error on your ass. <laughs> well, I it's magic cover. First date on who? Herself, nice. I mean, she did take some damage. What's her, what's her some rough times as a chicken? Huh? Black. Okay, how is my lady looking? She's looking fine, actually. Yeah, that's what I said. Fine looking lady. <laughs> I'm glowy. This is not even my final form. So awesome to do this. Just fuck everything else. I want to die. <laughs> yeah, you get it. Yeah, Max yeah. Stab critical. Oh god. Hello. Dude, it's the comic relief of this whole thing. What well, the comic relief was arg. <laughs> it was until the until the fucking the traitor with the that's drunk and under like mutton is, is came in. I can't see bullshit. Okay, that sucks. Rip. I am not gonna be able to do my thing this turn. Although I could maybe do that. Okay, I can I can stun one of them. The the monk has no physical armor. No magic armor, you mean? Uh uh yeah, so no physical, that's what I mean. This person. I was looking for the one that's gonna be actual threat, so I'm just Ow. There we go. That, that tickled. Path interrupted. I mean, where do we... Where do I exactly want to go here? Do I want to maybe deal with the monk? Um, more thinking the geist's a bigger problem. Okay. But like, if you can deal with the geist. Like, do you have chicken claw or anything? Any kind of... Any kind of stun? Yeah, uh, that's 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 off, and I can't even use it anymore right now because they, they have a they have, they have ma uh, physical armor that's blocked by physical. Uh... Right, I might as well just do that. <laughs> you bitch slap that guy. Oh no. No, that's a No! She has so many places to go. Defend me or die. Stop her! Alright. I can Can I use a movement speed of zero? Well, I can shocking arrow this guy. Remember shocking doesn't stun, it just slows yeah. him down. I mean it actually I could do knockdown arrow too. Fuck. Maybe I should have just done that. No, oh, not right. that was blocked by oh, right. Just so bad. Whoops, my bad. I keep forgetting that there's two things. Oh, it doesn't matter. It's all intentional. With the help of a half demon malady, the god woken escaped through the veil that separates life from death. Oops. The air here has a familiar smell, like the place you grew up. Old memories begin to well within you, but the sweet sour smell of decay suddenly punctures them. Look around and realize you've been here before. A faint creaking sounds in the distance. Well, rip our, uh, <laughs> I still have shackles of pain. Yeah, you still have shackles of pain. <laughs> spirit vision, this character can see spirits. Is that a tree? What's hanging from it? I don't know. Let's just find a way back to the ship. I don't know what we're talking about. There's a tree in the foreground. In the foreground? Background, sorry. Foreground. I, oh, I get mixed thing. up sometimes. Uh, oh, there's the gods. Uh, I'm going to guess one of the gods is your god. Relic. Uh, hey, you want to go to adventure? Where? Ha 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 ha.
You know I can, you know I can make myself fly, right? <laughs> yeah, but fuck it. What is that? High quality tormented soul tortured raw. Oh yeah. Held <laughs> to your ear, the skull echoes a faint, horrible wail. Uh, I'll take that. Excellent find. Good old torture draw. Hey, you want to lift back? Nah, I got this. You don't get a choice. You're a fucker. <laughs> yeah, and we're gonna do declare war. I was against you said of it. The gods. Are they dead? How can this be? Uh, I don't know, I'll talk to some of them. Amadia hangs before you, her face cut and bruised, her chest barely moving. You think you see a tear run down her cheek. You lean in. That's no tear. It's source. The shimmering liquid is seeping from her wounds and dripping to the ground below her. Oh shit, I need that. I'm gonna talk to Relic. I mean, he's, he's dead. His helmeted head hangs slack at his side, but a barely audible wheeze rasps from his lips. If I... Hurry! <laughs> yeah. Where's the lizard one? Got a lizard through here. Cursed tendrils tighten around Zolstissa. Her lips are moving, but no words seem able to escape her lips. Alright, well, everything's fucked, so... Gonna bless him. Green eyes glint with sudden uh, fire from behind the helmet. It's Are we a... the first. The others, do they hang still upon the tree? You want to say someone? Eh? I, I mean, I don't know. Fine, I'll say someone. I'll just... No, I was asking if you want to say something. Oh, nothing. No. Why? He strains at the ethereal ropes that bind him, resisting their grip. You must make haste. I am bound, but not defeated. Not yet. I probably should just go talk to my person. She'll probably say similar yeah. things. Yeah. Could do it. As the cursed tendrils slacken, Zorstissa inhales deeply, air wheezing into her throat. Wheezes become a hum, then a gently wavering song. A champion I called. My champion did come. First among my chosen, first among them. Together we gazed into the black. We turned our backs to it. We turned. We turned. You have come. My prince. My chosen. It is not too late. Not yet. But almost. Ask what happened here. Last you saw the seven were waging war against one another. Yes. And while we quibbled, an enemy greater than any one of us stole in like a thief in the night. But... Here you are, my chosen, my god-woken, our hope. You will undo what has been done. I saw it as I drifted here, at the midpoint between reality and oblivion. I saw, I saw Rivalon, but there was no Rivalon. There were no people, no ancient empire, none of our people, none of our great works. I grow cold now, even thinking about it. It was not a dream, Godwoken. It was a threat. A promise from our enemy. The enemy you and you alone can stop. It was a vision of the void. And it made me tremble with fear. So it can't be. She, she's afraid, the goddess who blessed you with a kiss? Yes, my prince. I, the goddess, I who created you, tremble. Soon the Seven will be nothing but morsels in the moors of the Void. Unless you do as I bid you. Do what I blessed you for. You have already set loose some of the powers locked within you. But there is a great well of possibility as yet untapped. You cannot stop until you ascend to the highest heights of your power. You cannot stop until you become divine, like Lucian. 
You will be called to unite the powers of the Seven against the Void. Like Lucian, you will lead our proud people to preeminence. But unlike Lucian, your weakness will not lead you to foolish failure. Uh, nods so that's exactly what you'll do. She opens her mouth to respond, but stops dead. Her head jerks from side to side, searching for something unseen. You, you must hurry. I hear it singing to me. Fire and ice, death and skulls, blackness, blackness. Go! White hot cold pierces your heart like a blade. You are frozen to the spot. The burning cold pumps through you like a curse, and then... Alright, well, peace out. What's happened here? The same troubled look is visible on each face. You've seen the gods beaten and defiled, strung up as a warning. Yep, let's play the game. When a general fails, his army often breaks. If Ralik himself couldn't stand against the void, what chance do I have? When a general <laughs> falls, his army often breaks. If Ralik himself couldn't stand against the void, what chance do I have? Uh, the gods are dead, lobby of the god woken. If the seven should indeed come to nothing, I'll be ready for, to take their place. What can yet be blessed can yet be restored. One way or another, divinity will survive through all of you and all of me. So, so, Beast doesn't have any divinity though. He's like, well, fuck Beast. What the hell? Why, why is Dwarf talking to him? Look who Dwarf is talking to. Wait, what? <laughs> Praise Lucian! A sincere face in, in sincere time! Hail Hydra! I can trade with him. <laughs> He's on the fucking other floor, though. You know what? Beast has long arms. Well, it's, uh... Do you want to listen in? Oh, you yeah, listen yeah, no, I'm listening. His listening. eyes travel from your face to your feet, then back again. <laughs> His eyes travel from your face to your feet? <laughs> You're cle clearly no magister. Dirty face, haphazard garb. How did you come to be here? What? What's going on? Uh, uh, <laughs> um, uh, tell of the truth. You're a sorcerer, recently escaped from Fort Joy, and he is. Name's Gareth. I'm a seeker. I can give you shelter <laughs> and hope. The fuck? Um. He's using telepath <laughs> telepathy. It's like, I'm, no, it's time travel and telepathy. I'm talking to him in the past. <laughs> Tell Gareth you'll take any help you can get, especially if it means getting off this island. What? A wise the choice, fuck? sorcerer. I'll mark a safe place on your map. What? Thanks, buddy. His eyes scan the horizon and then settle on yours. A moment past. <laughs> the horizon? <laughs> I can't stay. <laughs> the fuck you, Shelter? I can't I stay. Ah, yes. Evil feasts on the indolent. Oh, yeah. Get yourself to safety, and soon. You'll always have a place at the Seeker's table. Alright. That's funny. I was wondering why Beast didn't get a conversation in that dialogue. Yeah. Because uh, I saw him talking already, so. Alright, uh, we're gonna we're gonna leave it up here, guys. So thank you very much for watching, and uh, we'll see you guys next time. Goodbye. Goodbye. <laughs>